Hello and welcome to the screencast for Latin 330 for the reading of Unit 6, Reading 1, Caesar and Cicero. Marco Tullio Cicerone Oratore et Gaio Antonio Consolibus Anno ab Urbe Candita Sexicatissimo Octogissimo Nono Lucius Sergius Catalina Nobilissimi Viris Generis Vir Sed Ingenii Avissimi ad lindum patriam canioravit cum cubistam claris sed audacibus viris. Ac corone urbe expulsus est, so he eis de princi in carcare strangulati sunt. Ab Antonio altero consule Catalina ipsa victus prolio et interfectus. Okay, so um, this passage starts off with a long. Avil absolute, actually two of them. These are Avil absolutes, and they are used to show dates. So, in the year of the consulship of Marcus Tullius Cicero and Gaius Antonius, so that's the consular year. And the other one is the AUC date. Um, in the 689th year, so 689th year. From the foundation of the city. Lucius Sergius Catiline, a man of noble birth, most noble birth, sorry, but of most depraved talent, conspired with certain famous but um, bold or reckless men, conspired to destroy the, the fatherland. So that whole sentence together. With Marcus Tullius Cicero and Gaius and with Marcus Tullius Cicero the orator and Gaius Antonius being consuls. In the six hundred and eighty ninth year from the foundation of the city, Lucius Sergius Catiline, a man of most noble race, but of most depraved talent, conspire with certain famous, but indeed reckless men, to destroy the fatherland. All right. He was expelled from the city by Cicero. His allies, having been caught, were strangled in jail, in prison. Catiline himself, conquered, um, was killed in battle by Antonio, Antonius, the other consul. Okay, again, so uh, he was expelled from the city by Cicero. His allies, having been caught, were strangled in prison. Catiline himself, conquered in battle, was killed by the other consul, Antonio, Antonius. Anno urbis candita sexcantissimo nonagissimo tertio, Gaius Julius Caesar qui postia imperavit, cum Lucio Bibulo consul factus est, decreta est e Gallia et Illyricum, cum legionibus decum, is primus wicket heretios, qui nunc sequani appellantur, Diende wicindo per bella gravissima usque ad oceanum Britannicum processit. Domuit autem novum rem fere omnum gallium, quae inter apes flumen rodanum renum et oceanum est et circuitui patit et bis et tricies cantina milia passum. Okay, so another, another date. Um, in the 693rd year, for the foundation of the city. Gaius Julius Caesar, qui who afterwards ruled as factus was made consul nominative, with Lucius Bibulus. Alright, so in the 693rd year in the foundation of the city, Gaius Julius Caesar who afterwards 
ruled, was an emperor, was made consul with Lucius Fibulus. A, to him, Gallia et Illyrica, Gaul and Illyricum, were decreed with ten legions. He, this is Caesar here, he first conquered Alvetia, Alvetians, Qui, who now are called the Sequani, then, this is the gerund, by conquering, by conquering through war's most grave, he proceeded all the way to the, the British Ocean, uh, North Sea Channel, um, the British Ocean. Domuit Altum, okay, uh, he f finally, he, he conquered, um, Hanum Nolan Ferry in almost nine years, almost nine years he conquered all of Gaul, which is, is between the Alps, the River Rhone, the Rhine, and the ocean, so which is here, uh, between the, between the Alps, the River Rhone, and the Rhine, and the ocean, and it extends uh, in circumference. Uh, to, so to twice, three, to two, so it's twice and three hundred, so six hundred miles, six hundred miles. That's one more time for the whole sentence. Um, he conquered, he subdued all of Gaul in almost nine years which is between the Alps, the Rhone River, and the Rhine, and the ocean. And it extends, in circumference, uh, 600 miles. Millia Possum is a mile. Bratanis mox in bellum and tulit, quibis ante eum ne nomen quidem romanorum cognitum est erat. Eos que victos obsidibus acceptus stipendarios fecit. Galliae autum tributi nomine annuum imperavit stipendium quadrigentiae, germanos que trans reinum aggressus et manissimus prolius vicit. Okay. Soon he took war to Britain, um, to whom the British, to whom for him, not even the name of the Romans had been heard, had been learned, so they didn't know their names. Uh, he made he made them conquered, and with hostages accepted, he made them um, tributaries. Okay. Uh, Moreover, of the Gauls, okay, of the Gauls, um, in the name of tributes, he ordered an annual tax of 40,000, 4,000, uh, 40,000, 40,000 sesterces. Um, he conquered, so having gone across, sorry, having gone across the Rhine, he conquered the Germans in very large battles right, from the beginning of this slide here. Soon he took war to Britain, to the British, to whom before him not even the name of Romans had been heard, had been learned. He made them conquered, and with hostages accepted, he made them tributaries. So Pickett does both objects, Aeos and Stipendiaris. Um, of the Gauls, however, in the name of tribute, he ordered them to pay an annual tax of 40,000 sesterces. Sesterces is that. Um, and he conquered the Germans, having gone across the Rhine, in huge battles.
he of course here is Caesar all right that's it for reading one